Hello. Today I'm going to teach you how to control a servo using the MyOware sensor by Advanced Technologies. So today I'm using an Arduino Uno. A MyOware muscle sensor. A high torque servo. Angled header pins. A 9.6 volt butterfly type battery with a small type to media connector. An adapter to attach my battery to the board. Three electrodes. Male to male jumper wires, female to male jumper wires, a soldering iron, and some solder, and a helping hand to help me solder. So here we have the Myower Muscle Sensor by Advancer Technologies. Here I have three header pins which I'm going to solder onto the Myower. So first, I'm going to attach my battery adapter to the Arduino Uno board. To do this, I'm going to attach the positive end to the V-in and the negative end to ground. Now, if I attach my butterfly type battery, the board should power up. Now, to attach the MyOR to the Arduino board, first I'm going to get the positive lead and attach that to the 3.3 volt output on the Arduino board. Then I'm going to get the negative lead and attach that to ground. And lastly, I'm going to attach the signal lead to the A3 port on the Arduino board. This is all we have to do to attach our MyOware to the Arduino board. Here I have my servo and attached to it are three male to male jumper wires. So first I'm going to get the signal and attach it to pin 9. I'm going to get the positive lead and attach it to the 5 volt output and then I'm going to get my negative lead and attach it to the ground. This is all you need to make this circuit work. Here is the program that I wrote to work with my MyOware circuit. First I included the servo library, then I named my servo then I created a constant integer value called thresh value. I'll go more into what this does in a second. In the setup I attach my servo to pin 9 in the Arduino board. In the loop I create an integer called value which is equal to the analog read of pin A3 on the Arduino board. 
pin A3 is the same pin that MyOware is attached to. So in this if statement, it says, if the value of the MyOware is less than this thresh value that we created up here, then it'll tell the servo to move to a certain position. To move the servo, I chose to write in microseconds. This best suited my needs. So, if the value is not less to the stretch value, then it'll go to the else and move to this position here. For this thresh value, it varies from person to person. My thresh value was 250. With this program and the myware attached to your bicep, you'll be able to manipulate the servo by flexing your bicep. Now it's time to upload the program to the Arduino and then we can test it out. Now the final step is to attach the myware to your bicep or whatever muscle you prefer and then attach the battery to the battery adapter. Now whenever I flex the servo will move. I can even hold the servo to its max position, then let go.